little great. Oh, he won first game. That's I guess he crazy. was. I guess uh, Aztec was just playing by himself. Yep. He lost. <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> to I don't know what computer level is that. We're about to see. We're about to see. Nine. nine. <laughs> what? Yep. Mm. You should not play against level nine computers. It's actually pretty bad. Zero says. Yeah, playing against level nine computers, they're kind of wonky. They, yeah, they perfect uh, air dodge every single time. Oh yeah, they just attack. know. Yeah, so like actually practicing against level nine computers is going to throw off your game so much because you're just gonna be like, I'm never gonna do anything in the air because you'll dodge it. But it's yeah. like you're playing against a computer, <laughs> so you know. Okay, so we're gonna have to actual warm ups because this is gamer. Mm, yep. So. Right now, Lord Wolfass is just trying out his Falcon, throwing out some moves. Uh -oh. showing off those okay, moves. you gotta be careful. Don't get run into the lights. Ah! <laughs> yep, 20% damage. It also is really high. That was a good back. tech, though. Yeah. <laughs> Teched it off the top of the ceiling. Oh. The, I, I thought at first like he was just like a like one disrespectful up air onto Aztec and then was, that was it, but no. Gamer is scary in game Wario. Uh -huh. Yeah. Where sometimes where she will just walk up to the table and just stare at you. <laughs> I mean seriously. After that she'll just run out and break the window. She's like a mannequin zombie mom. That's the scariest kind of mom. Definitely top five. Oh she's a gamer. Scary zombie. Five bullet is a game. Five bullet is a gamer. Scary zombie mom gamer uh, mannequin girl. Oh, She's she also is. really cute as well. She, I mean, listen, if gray's your palette, dude, mm -hmm. go for it. I just, I need a woman with a little more color, you know? Oh, she has a lot of color. <laughs> Let's just say, um, she doubled the score compared to nine bolt. Oh, okay. It was at 500 and she managed to get 1,000. Mm -hmm. If you ever played the game of Wario series, this is I, my favorite one. I've played the only Wario where All right. title... I think they're going to be starting now. Um, yeah, they are. Look, he's... Okay. The only one i played is the one for GameCube. Um, I forgot what it's called. It's like WarioWare Inc. something. Ah, WarioWare Inc. Uh, Mega Party Games. Yep. That was that one was a lot of fun. Me and my brother tried to beat it a couple times, and we ended up beating it a few times, but just, like when it gets up to like 9 volt, mm -hmm. oh my god, that game, Jesus. Oh man! All right, so now we're gonna be choosing the yep. legal stage Starterville, I believe. And give it a second, three, two, one. Oh, we're starting. All mm -hmm. right, all right. First singles match of the night: Lord Whoopass and Aztec. So um, I feel like Aztec's got a pretty good advantage. Uh, just like player wise, uh, not player, like character wise. Um, if Aztec throws out like Zares and stuff, and um, he throws out PK fires, and Lord Wolfass can't get in, he doesn't have a whole lot of options. Yeah, you better punch yeah. that. Catch the Falcon, always like a projectile. Mm -hmm. All right, getting Lord Wolfass off stage. Which is the reason, like, you come across a lot of people who play Captain Falcon, and a lot of people who play him are just more like, ah, oh, he's fun. You know, he's just a wacky character that really makes, like, Newbies mad like he just he's really good at just like keeping people up. I don't know, but what, what can I say? Random screaming. <laughs> <laughs> the Captain Falcon strategy is to just do true knees and scream in your opponent's <laughs> ear. That's the Captain Falcon strategy. Oh, oh double back two, air. yeah, two back airs off trying the to stage. Read, trying to read an up smash. Mm -hmm. Down throw. He went for the up tilt there. Aztec was able to get out of it. Back it down to the base of the stage now. Oh, Ooh, throw missing. Just out of range of the yep, grab. And the strike is going ahead and take out the first stock. So even though Aztec has had the lead percent wedge, I think the whole game, he did lose the first stock of the match. Fair, uh, sweet spot. Not gonna kill, though. Ah, uh, just running into these grabs. Another good fair was able to get Lord Lopez to the inside of the stage. Oh, oh the footstool is able to kill. All right, let's go. Luke, uh, Aztec living at not a terrible percent right now, mm -hmm. um, but Captain Falcon dishes out a lot of damage. He's just your your typical speedy, powerful, brawling jerk. Yeah. Then say you just make a combo by Nair. Already at sixty two percent. It's weird too because Nair, Lucas's Nair is actually pretty easy to get out of. I mean, well, it does have an SDI multiplayer of two, which is. I don't know, because it was on the initial release that um, 
He does have an SDI in multiplayer, too. Mm -hmm. Aztec uses those nares a lot more than I feel like a regular Lucas player does. Mm -hmm. uh, your regular Lucas player will, like, go... Oh, what? Out of range. Oh, no! Oh, that sucks. What's up, RZI? Mm -hmm. Uh, so... Oh, man. It sucks to see the first game go like that, but uh, Aztec was just out of range of his, uh, the grab getting back onto stage, and he was too far down off the screen to actually get off the... The PK, I think I said PK Rocket. Yeah, PK yeah. Rocket for Lucas, PK Missile for Ness. If you want Remember to say that. that. Mm -hmm. All right, going back to Smashville. So immediately, um, Aztec just sort of throwing out his air there. He hasn't been using his range a whole lot to his advantage. Like, um, there, he started throwing out PK Fires a little later into the first match. Um, but a lot of the time, he's just trying to get up, up close and personal with Captain Falcon and try and, like, maybe get a grab or two. Mm -hmm. But Captain Falcon wins the up-close matchup, so Aztec probably wants to start spacing maybe a little more than he has been. I mean, his, uh, I mean Lucas's range has been uh, decreased in Brawl. Yep, so Since Brawl. he is going to have to work on making sure he just doesn't walk into like that, like yeah, a forward smash from Captain Falcon. Yeah, he's like uh, approaching with Nairs a lot. Mm -hmm. Like I said, Lucas's Nair, even though it works for Aztec a lot, isn't. Lucas's most desirable move. It's good right there yeah. when he can't get out of it, and SDI did an SDI out of it, so it is able to rack up some damage on Lord Wolf Ask. Give credit where credit is due. Lord Wolf Ask just sort of like running back and forth, shielding the PK fires and going up and grabbing, and now the back air is going to get uh, Aztec off stage. Makes up some mind games. Yeah, a lot of mind games this matchup for Lord Wolf Ask. That's, that's basically Cam Falcon's game plan, though. Yeah. Yep. Only gonna get oh, the Raptor did hit! Oh, the strike! See you later! Oh, man, it just got the very end of it, too. Alright, recovering low. Mm hmm. Alright, he's able to run off the platform and get uh, Lord Wolfass to the right side of the stage. But we're reversing the situation now. Aztec now sort of in a dangerous position. He was in this position before the last game. He was able to footstool him to that level. Basically, at the same percent last game where Lord Lord, uh, Lord Lopez died. So hopefully, Aztec can get something going. Going for the up tilt there. Ooh. Couple. Oh, oh up there. Lord Lopez almost getting the force. Man. Yeah, Aztec. just wasn't quite able to kill. Tried to get the two right in there. Not quite. All right. That's nice. Got All right. Yep. So at 77 percent, a little higher than he was last game. Aztec is still alive. He's still living. Dash attack puts. I. Aztec does not want to be in the air right now. Lord Whoopass has been so good. Ooh, perfect chilling. That's Rapper not going to kill. No. Um, Captain Falcon already at 0%. Uh, couple of jabs getting Aztec to the left side of the stage. All right, yep. Yeah, rack, up, rack up that damage. Couple of jab moves from Aztec. All Some right. more nares. Uh, three of them in a row! And tried to go for the up air. Going for it again. But that's the damage he needs. Potential foot tool. Yeah, that was a good attack uh, from Lord Wolfaz. The down B slowing Aztec as he's able to get back on the stage. Back on. Grabbing on. Luckily, that that time, throw connected. Okay. Oh, I think mm. he's not going to go for a throw in his set. Oh, there oh. you go. Tower spot. Back air. Alright, just opting to get out of that situation instead. Up B is going to send Aztec to the left side of the stage. Oh, Lord Lopez going for that down tilt, expecting him to immediately come back up. Down and that down tilt will kill. So Lord Lopez takes that set two games to zero. Great Captain Falcon to play. I mean, he was up. Those mind games, though, where he just kept running back and forth. Like, you can't touch me. You yeah. can't touch me. Guess what? I'm going to touch you. Bam. Throw. See you later. Yeah, I guess and then, that's only one way how you uh, counter a person.